Hello everyone, we are back with another video and we are back in the most popular campsite in Tanay, Viewscape Nature Park. And on this vlog, we will be sharing with you how a group of 14, labing apat na katao, plus a baby girl, plus four floofy babies, survived an overnight camping trip. few moments later
Hello everyone, I am Annie and we are back with another video. <laughs> Shout out. Dapat talaga alas kami ngayon eh. But unfortunately, nagbago ang isip ng husband ko. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stay in. Mukhang sinisipag ako mag-edit today. While I'm editing, I decided to just do a voiceover. But I'm not sure. Let's see if I'm gonna include this whole bit right here. Kasi parang mukhang okay din siya. May pa-arting ganyan. But anyway, I have a script ready. And I'm just gonna go ahead and read through it. Anywho, let's get down to business. Okay. As you may already know, kaming dalawa lang talaga ng husband ko ang nagka-camp together with our four floofers, of course. When we do camp with friends, it's usually with camper friends, you know, camping buddies. Meaning, ang norm usually ay kanya-kanyang setup, kanya-kanyang mundo, until one visits the camp of the other. And of course, during bonfire sessions. But this time around, we are camping with family members. Family members who are not as addict, well, as mahilig sa camping as we are. So technically, my husband and I will be acting as their guide during this trip. So, for avid car campers like us who plan to take your family or friends with you on your next camping trip, here's a list of things that you might want to consider doing. I only came up with, you know, four stuff, but hopefully this helps. Okay. First, set their expectations. Explain the general feel of camping, especially yung weather, kasi hindi naman 24-7, you know, malamig. Pwede yung pagdating nyo doon, tulad ng case sa case namin. Habang nag-set up kami, medyo maaraw pa, so medyo mainit. Explain nyo rin na may mga insekto here and there, you know, mga salagubang, tutubi, alitap-tap, and minsan may mga langgam pa na mga galit na galit mga agat. Ganun. Of course, isama nyo na rin yung condition ng CR, yung shower area. This is important especially sa mga nagpa-plandalhin yung mga senior parents nila or maybe their babies. Kasi baka pagdating nyo sa campsite, ayaw pala nila ng mga ganong eksena, mga ganong condition. So, basagan lang talaga ng trip ang only game na malalaro nyo pagdating nyo doon. Number two, send a list of things to prepare. Since my husband and I have gone through several camping trips already, we can say naman na we have a general idea of the things that we need to prepare for an overnight trip. So we sent a list to a group chat that we created so that each family is aware of the things that they need to bring and prepare. This is from basic things like their tent, their shelter, you know, to food and storage. Because hello, ant attack. Number three, share camping etiquette. Since ayaw din namin makaistorm ba sa iba, as well as ayaw din namin ma-report and ma-blind item ba sa Car Camping Philippines, we made sure that we reminded everyone in the group about the basic camping etiquette. Such as, of course, respecting your camp neighbor by not being loud, whether by, you know, talking or playing music, especially during quiet hours. There were times, though, that we needed to remind the group, especially the kids, uh, to take it down a notch whenever they forget uh, or they don't notice that their music is a little too loud. And of course, respecting nature by following the leave no trace rule. And last but not the least, number four, fourth tip, everyone has to help, especially when setting up and breaking camp. Camping with family can be a great bonding experience only if everyone takes part in the activities. Kasi, you know, if there's only one person doing all of the tasks, then syempre mahahagar yung taong yun. Ang kakaluto, kakaprepare ng dining area, kakalinis ng dishes, you know, everyone has to help out. So yeah, those are the things that I feel like that are most helpful for you to consider if you're eventually you know, planning to well, recap. I hope this video helps. If you find this video entertaining or useful, please, you know, you know what to do. Ayun lang. See you on our next camping video. Bye!